Welcome. Thank you for joining me for this overview, a uh, quick start of the Module 4 Discussion Board. So the Module 4 Discussion Board focuses on the efforts made by businesses or organizations to be sustainable. One of the things I really appreciate about this week's Discussion Board is that each of us gets to select a topic for our own post. And in that way, we all have the opportunity to direct the discussion, to explore different ideas and consider things we may not otherwise have considered. So for this quick start video, we're gonna share a couple of tips about actually writing the discussion board and the response posts, as well as look at that grading rubric. So let's go ahead and get started. In this discussion board, you're asked to share your experiences with the business or organization that you frequently engage with and assess how it is sustainable. For your initial post, you'll want to describe the practices of the business or organization, those practices that it uses, and you're going to think about identifying that business or organization as being sustainable or not. You're going to want to also note how it is socially responsible. And then you're going to look for ways that it might be engaging in the practice of greenwashing. So as you draft your post, please remember to practice using key vocabulary terms that we've learned along the way. For example, you might be able to add in some evidence that the business or the organization, that their leadership practices are ego or eco. So think about those kinds of things as you're describing it. And of course, make sure that you're addressing each one of those points on the prompt. Then for your two response posts, and please remember you do need to make two response posts in order to earn full credit here. So here are a few things that you want to consider as you're drafting that response post. You're going to focus your response post on the business or organization that the original post described and tell us if you agree or disagree with the assessment made in that post. Is the business organization engage, or organization engaging in greenwashing? Is it socially responsible? Think about those things. Then after reading the initial post, do you think the sustainability practices the business or organization is employing are working? Why or why not? Maybe you can give some examples or respond to the examples given in the original post. So remember, you'll want to take some time here to choose which posts you're replying on based on the business or organization that they are focusing on. And as always, let's take a look at the uh, discussion board rubric, which should be very familiar to you by now. This is the fourth module that we've used this rubric. I'm gonna go through the rubric row by row as I always do and focus in on things specific to this week's assignment. So for that first row comprehension, I'm looking for um, you to share examples of how the business or organization uses sustainability practices including any examples of ways the business or organization is socially responsible or examples of greenwashing. As always, timeliness, simply put, did you make your initial post before the Thursday night deadline? Remember, I want to encourage you to make those original posts on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, because that gives us more time to have that conversation back and forth. And I love the conversations that we're having there, so let's encourage that. Okay. Then the last uh, two rows here, engagement. Engagement really focuses in on your response posts. So for those, did you explain why you agree or you disagree with the assessment of the original author of that post? Um, and tell us why you agreed or disagreed. And then of course in writing, are your posts clear, concise, are they easy to understand? Did you take time to draft them before you posted them? Okay. Thank you so much for joining me for this quick start video. I look forward to seeing those posts uh, and replying to them, of course. Um, have a great week. And if you've got any questions, as always, reach out to me. I'm here to support you.